your dad, I guess, yes. Um, so, your book... Oh, is it? I'll just trade with you. Okay. So, I read Camry's book. It came out earlier this year. If you guys are looking for an amazing read, this is one. You've got Reyes coming up, but you've got one right now that you can buy right up at the front that's amazing. One of the things that was super comforting to me reading your book is that you actually have a good relationship with your dad. Well, well, double fist that there, Camry. Fit those in your pussy. <laughs> Sure. But I have a little something. You share a lot too. And I love this little thing behind me. Oh, that's yeah. Screw Hallmark. I made my own damn card. That's a card my dad wrote. Uh, what's the do you have the front of it? Oh my god, my my dad's cards, his drawings from prison are quite possibly the best thing ever. Like Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah, he makes draws me in a bathing suit with tattoos that I don't have that he has. Uh, so my tattoos are on his uh, his tattoos are on my body. It's very fucked up. But um, yeah, they're hilarious. They're real and they're he's a, an amazing artist. But they're bizarre. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it, was com it was comforting to me that reading your book and knowing that you like came out okay on the other side. So a beating heart of Camry's book is Camry herself, obviously, but also your mom. Your mom is such a beating heart of this book, and I have this amazing clip of you too. And this is Lisa Lampanelli's footage of them at Camry's book party. story coming out because the deaf community, my whole family's deaf, not just my dad, my mom, my aunts, uncles, uh, grandparents, everybody's deaf, um, except for me and my brother and my cousins. Actually, that's very typical on deaf sides of the family. Having that generational deafness is very rare. 90% of deaf children are born to hearing parents, and 90% of deaf parents have hearing children. But um, we grew up generationally deaf in the tight-knit deaf community. She was just paranoid in her whole life that she was abused by my dad. It, she wanted very desperately to keep all that stuff under wraps. So for this to now just be out there was frightening for her. But then she saw just how amazing that at the book party people, how much they loved her and appreciated her story. And I've been forwarding her the emails from readers that have buoyed her spirit and have reassured her that this was the right thing. Yeah, yeah it's a wonderful book. Camry Cruz, thank you for coming on.